Hey guys, today we're going to learn a really cool pose. It's a, uh, a half bow position in reverse bird. So reverse bird bow looking thing. Uh, my lovely assistant Maggie today and I will be demonstrating um, some things to look out for in terms of falling and also how to do it correctly. So here we go. We're going to start to get into reverse bird. I really enjoy this cartwheeling into reverse bird. It's pretty fun. Otherwise you can just get into reverse bird from back here. Um, falls to look out for when you're go ahead and get into it Magda uh, when your flyer gets into this position her arms are bound that means she's taken away one of her landing pieces landing gear so if you start falling this way down on her head um, the fly needs to let go of that foot so she can brace with her hand and bring her foot down so be really mindful of falling back down this way okay and I'm going to show you how to keep her safe so the flyer will get back here we'll start reverse bird again. Okay, so the first thing I do, watch. I'm going to find her hip bones with my left foot there. Uh, put it on the balls of my foot. Right there I'm going to find her hip bone, front hip bone. I'm going to twist my foot turning in towards her hips. And then using my arm, my left hair, I'm grabbing her heel and pulling her down. So I'm counter uh, leveraging the weight that she's putting uh, behind me here so I'm pulling down towards me down this way and then she's slowly gonna come up and grab her top foot I'm keeping this foot here so that she doesn't fall for now watch how uh, she grabs her foot but the way that she balances herself is she's using um, the flyer takes their foot and she's actually pulling her foot away from her arm creating this nice tension there and the more that she pulls back this way the easier it is for her to balance the weight that is coming back this way. So she pull, she's pulling her leg back this way. She's also opening, she's straddling her legs wide out and that helps to balance, balance, helps her from tipping over this way. So she's really bringing her weight out that way, okay? And then she's pulling back as well. And then I'm slowly gonna take this foot away, balance. I'm constantly pulling down on this hand this way and she's gonna bow up. And then that's your reverse bird bow. You can also grab this foot if you're fancy they come out like that. Nice, Mac. And coming down, just bring the foot down. First. It's a really fun pose. It's very hard. You can tell that she worked really hard to keep her core tight. Again, as she's pulling that bow, she's taking that leg and pulling it away from her, creating some weight to pull back this way. And she's pulling back. She's also opening her leg out like that. And that helps her really counterbalance the weight that that would pull it towards her torso to pull it back that way. So until next time, guys, have fun and be safe.